Fuck it. There's definitely gonna be a gimmick for this in a second. Yeah. Alright, so... Right now, you three are selectable. Like, it might- Oh! This is dumb. Hit B to exit combat. And then... Go to the- the- the computer terminals. Well, you gotta turn to face it, I guess. How do you exit combat? It's forcing combat when you get fucking attacked. Uh, uh. Look at the top of the screen. Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay, no, never mind. Mm hmm. Alright, there we go. Uh, Disable the generator. Yeah, I only, I mean, I only have eight. Yeah, but you get spikes by out of the bins them. by killing them. That's how it works. Okay. Or you can have a droid on droid battle. Yeah. So, see if you can get into that, uh... Yeah, okay, that's how it works. That's the fight. So you killed a bunch of- Oh, that's why! When you kill them, that's why this flashes. Okay. Because each one you kill gives you some spikes. Okay, you got this. So you're gonna need eight, you have five now. Yeah. Just keep killing, Bacchus. So there's, there is a benefit to... That's not gonna happen while you're in that spot. No, it has to be the one next to you. Hmm... The game is, is, is pushing the limits of its own engine. Yeah. Effectively. It's, it's trying a bunch of shit. And it's... It's like... No, it works. It technically works. This one. Because it has to be the specific one to each panel. So if you ran around to the others, there's probably a bunch in there. Like that one, for example. Two. That should be enough, actually, I think. I think you have eight. This looks like it controls well. <laughs> what? Disable that shit. That's two down. You crazy. What the fuck? Oh my god. There we go. Right, create some distance. You do this. And then into battle. And then... Now. Yeah, and each time you do this, like, less and less are gonna spawn in, so... Fuck. Uh, so... Yeah, let's go, let's do the whole round and, and get and, as and, many and, of these. Exactly, yeah, exactly. One spike. Like, like the types are yeah the types are slowing this down for sure yeah all right that's already disabled so it should be empty uh maybe it doesn't hurt yeah there's a spike your regeneration is like helping actually a lot well because each one's like four five four right and I'm getting one 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 so these are not re these are meant to be annoyances while you solve the puzzle this huge traumatic puzzle. Alright, that's enough for, uh, that's all of them. So that's enough for one for sure. Fuck. Fuck off. Control's great. Yay, that's half of them down. The active ones from that type still stay active. Though. Yeah, until you kill them. But now, like, at the very least, three is gonna be such that it's easier to run around. I didn't mean to do that, but sure. Sure, why not? Oh god, now I don't know which computers are fixed. Anymore. Well, kill them, and the ones that they spawn from are yeah, the ones yeah, that yeah, are yeah, 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 yeah. Or the ones that have huge smoke in front of them are the ones, are the ones that are disabled. Yes, 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 yes. 
So it looks like you disabled all the ones on the right side of the room, actually. Oh no, the smoke is nothing. Where is it? I can't tell. Well, I know that one's still working for sure. I wonder if Malik's looking at this and like, shit. It's, yeah. Why are the fucking <laughs> controls next to the thing? Why would there be hack spikes next to each one? Fuck. That's pretty cool. Why'd I move it like that? Fucking shit. Man, just fighting this, these control. <laughs> the true last boss is the controls. Not, not enough. Oh boy. Oh man. Oh boy. Oh jeez. There you go. Nope. You never killed the Type D. Ah, oh, it's these these bins over here. Or not. Fuck it. It's the other bins over. <laughs> it's fucking shit. Oh, have you ever gotten any of these bins? No. No. Yar. You can turn that one off now. Fuck off! I'm pressing. I know. I can see. I can hear the clicks. <laughs> oh my god. Oh yeah. All, All right. right. <laughs> yeah. You're down to two now. Two should be somewhat easy to manage. I mean, again, I, I I have to say, like this would infuriate someone with a huge number. Oh yeah. Because it's just the biggest waste of time. Like Malik, you just jerking it over there. He's like, like, good on you for coming up with the ultimate time waster for something you can't beat. Okay, so the one directly in front of you is yes, yeah. And you can just keep killing that one as it spawns. Yeah, see, look, it just shows up right next to it each time. What the? Oh, I was like, you're trying to use. Oh wow, six. Is that enough? No. One more. Alright, that's it for this guy. Somehow escape combat pockets. Fight to escape. Alright, five down. Ooh. What an amazing final battle. I mean, it, it, you know, I don't mind the, the, the idea behind it if it were, like, about half as, as many. Think how trivial this would have been with your whole party. Oh, yeah, while well, they just held it down, right? Like, they have to, like, they have to make these a certain level of weakness. So that's even possible. Alright, where, where did they come Those from? were type Bs. Okay, well then, yeah, gotta go to the type B, uh... Yeah. Oh, type D. So that was B. This is type B. No, Wooly is behind you. No, that D is over there, but the ones I killed were Bs, I'm saying. Oh. You understand? So if whatever B is so glowing, yeah, glowing means, I assume. Yeah. I didn't even notice that until just now. Alright. So just kill this guy over and over as, well, he, as he spawns. No, but type Bs as well. What are you talking about? The, the ones I killed before this D guy yeah. were the type Bs. Yeah, that's the one you were standing at. You already got all. Did I already get yeah. them all? Okay, so he was just a remnant? Yeah. Alright. So yeah, turn around and see where he comes from. Yeah, so just kill him over and over last, as he spawns in. Last one, okay. Yeah. Alright. Alright. This is where the real climax happens. Kill as you stand in front of a droid maker and just wait for a second. Just wait a second. Okay, there's another one! I'm gonna get it! Okay, that's good. Okay, just give me a, give me a second. Jimmy, oh fucking Malik, god damn it. Oh, video games. Video girl. It's unfortunate that the, the huge high of turning on your party can't, like, maintain itself through the final dungeon. It can't. Because it has to do final dungeon stuff. But does it. Does like, it really? Like, ideally, like, Malik should have just been at the temple. Right? 
Like, you know, again, games are being games, but, like... Some, there's a point where it's like, yeah, you know what? Maybe we don't have to do that trope today. Alright, that might be enough. Let's check, see what happens. Maybe today we don't have to do that. Hey, look at that. Perfect. Maybe today is a day where we, we fucking just... We try to do things that keep excitement high. No. Fuck that. That's for losers. All right. Now here is a big power up. Let your force regenerate. Shit, save game. Every. Well, no, don't save now because you fucking your shit's all fucked. There's still an enemy in the room. Oh, he's, he's he? nice now, I guess. Oh, okay. Is he an enemy? No. Or is all he right. a friend? All right. Let's heal up and get all your force points back. No, not that one. Anything but that. There you go. All right, great. Let's just wait a second. Hey, Willie, what's going on? Oh, cause it's yeah, yeah. That's that's the door. Uh, well, I mean, well, how, what do you think about Kotor? I think this is a great game. I think that was a momentum-killing moment at the end there, and I think a lot of uh, RPGs and or uh, have long games have problem. this problem. Uh, it's tough for games to end particularly well. Um. Uh, would you say that this game, uh, lives up to its classic status? I would say so, uh, but here's the thing, the, the whole thing where it's like, it's hard for these games to end well, mm -hmm. problem, is you need a challenge, but you need, but, but, da, da, da. But you, you have to, you have to assume for the character that's maxed the fuck out, mm -hmm. and also the character that's built like shit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hey, look, your force points are back, now we can save safely. I, I understand that. But like when yeah, you look that's at it, tough. You, when you look at an encounter and you go, "This would be objectively better with nothing there." <laughs> that's rough. Yeah. That being said, that's not like fucking. That wasn't um, Star Force Triforce pieces. I mean, yeah. as try, you know what I mean? Like, I'm I'm a big fan of Mass Effect One, and you played that, I know. Yep. Where if uh, you can use just a talk, you talk choose him a into it. Lock prompt to skip an entire phase. Of the talk boss him into it. Absolutely. It's great. But. Don't fucking let the momentum drag itself to a... Well, let's have like, a big momentum now. The dog's, like, scrubbing its butt, a butt on the on the carpet, like, fucking momentum killer. That's cool, though. Malark! Oh, you're taking the drugs. Oh, man. Oh, look. Oh, Pocket's so high on drugs. No, Pocket's no. Oh my god, Pockets. Oh my- I can't believe it. I don't know how long these last. They might all wear off. I'm Look at my up arrows! Oh, I see him. I see him. Look at my up arrows! I see him. Hey, Malak, what up? Well done, Revan. I was certain the defenses of the Star Forge would destroy you. Oh, it's feeding on people. But I see yeah. There's more of your old self in you than I expected. You got to put force people you in are there. Stronger than I thought. Stronger than you ever were during your reign as the Dark Lord. I did not think that was possible. Yeah. Shut up. You are eager for blood, Revan. As am I. Very well. You shall have your wish. Once again, we shall face each other in single combat. I mean, and once again, you lost. The you didn't even. F it wasn't a fight. <laughs> I look at my. Oh, there's only four up arrows. Yeah, those don't last very long. Okay. Hit him. For what? Why do I get those points? Because you were like, I'm gonna kill you. Yeah, I guess so. I uh, dude, the buff that wore off was your fucking. Master speed. Yeah, it was. The single most important, important buff. one. Let's try that again. Thank you. Oh. Ah! Get him! Continue to amaze me, Revan. If only you keep fapping while you run. The true power of the Star Forge. You might have become truly invincible. God, but feeds on people. Of course it does. All you saw was an enormous factory. All you ever imagined Which means the Rakafans would have just been putting people in there no matter how, like, good they thought they'd be. Yeah. Blind it's inherently stupid. evil. You're stupid, Revan. Is there a point to this? The Star Forge is more than just a space station. In some ways, it is like a living creature. It hungers. 
and it can feed on the dark side that is within all of us. Yeah, Look okay. You, Revan. See the bodies? You should recognize them from the Academy. Ah. These are Jedi who fell when I attacked Dantooine. Yeah, they feed the for Force. For and purposes, dead. Except for one difference. I have not let them become one with the Force. Instead, I have brought them here. In a world where you can rip magic out of people, like yeah. turning them into batteries and feels like and they're they're somewhat inevitable. permanent batteries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you use them up. Beat me, Revan. Not here on the Star Forge. Not when I can draw upon the power of all these Jedi. What's stopping me from doing it? Beaten, I don't know. I do the same Why can't I do that? The same thing he just did. Like I literally just do a life suck on the on the thing. Power feeding me as I conquer the galaxy. Maybe you can't. You can. <laughs> Hit the button. Oh, fuck off. You don't, yeah, you don't have the option. What about this one? Try it. Nope. Only by using the power of the force could you free him now. Uh, okay, hold on. What force power would that be? Try lightning. I mean, he did, he did, um... Drain. Drain, right? Yeah, he did drain life. Try drain life. Yep, 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 yep. Let's do that. I mean, that'd be hilarious. It's like, you only I can do that. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Alright. Uh, yeah, Drain Life. I need to pause, though, to get to that one of that. Death Field, that's the one. You hit it. Did the ratio just change? No. Yeah, it doesn't seem to. Yeah! Full heal! That was a full heal! Fucking sick. So whenever he goes to do it, try when and beat him there. Yeah, yeah, and if you're evil, you can do it too. Or you just use them up for him, actually. And then he runs out, because there's a limited number in this room. Actually... Can you just go do that? I can probably do that. Let's go do that. Yeah, yeah don't hit him now. Well, hold on, because I still am, I'm like, you know. Cause yeah, there's a point where you can't beat him in, in on foot, right? Yeah. All right, let's go over there and drain life. Uh, that feels. Yeah, that's the same. Way. You do it. Or just do it from here. Yeah. Nice. Hits multiple. Go around and battery these fucks. How many more? There's two over more there. Over there. Can light side even do this? I bet there's a way to get them out with like force push or like. Oh, you get a buff from that, it looks like. That's all of them, I think. <laughs> oh, unless there's more up here. Oh, there's a couple more up here. I can't select anything else. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. I didn't see there was a second floor. My mistake. Come, let us continue. Uh, there's another one. One around the corner. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Go get that one. Let's continue this fucking folly. Oh, this is, this is amazing. This Just... Feeding. See, this is a cool fight. Feeding off of people for the dark side. This is a great it's fight. So evil. <laughs> this is so incredibly He's evil. Like, look what I can do. I'm so strong with this ability. Oh shit! Oh, I shouldn't have showed you how to do it. Oh crap! There you go. Oh, one more. Do it, do it, do it. Yeah! Now yeah, where? suck it! Now where? Nowhere? Im oh. <laughs> Impossible. I... I cannot be beaten. I am the dark did you just throw? That is a, something fell. I don't know what that was. Oh. That was the remote, probably. Well... Ah, uh, whatever. <laughs> I'm the true Sith! That's me, Parker. Yes. Suck it. Oh, I wait, you can't. You don't have a longer. jaw. <laughs> you are the one You're on this. You can't. Oh, no. Who deserves to be the Dark Lord? You were the one who found the first star map on 
done to Eden, Revan. <coughs> yes, yes. It was you who led us on our quest for the Star Forge. Don't forget to squirt your mouth with your, your dampener way. to keep the I top of your, your mouth dry. The roof must the just, you know, oh, yeah. must get really uncomfortable and crusty. Now I understand. Think about not having a jaw. Man, it's weird. Yours, I use my jaw a lot. So much. You. Especially us, I mean, you know, considering. You are Darth I mean, how else are you supposed to make money? Lord. I don't know. Lord I actually don't. And it makes me worried. <laughs> I... I am nothing. I was I was wondering. I'm like, are they gonna let you just let him revel? Oh yeah. The apprentice has learned his final lesson. Ooh. The second line is so much cringier. Yeah, but it is. So it ends, as I somehow always knew it must, in darkness. There. Wow. With that framing and those robes, like, your entire character is gone. Sure come a long way since Terrace. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Incoming ships. Yeah? How many? Infinity. What do you mean? I don't... Oh. Like, we were joking earlier about, like, ships just float, shooting, just coming out of the Star Forge firing. Mm -hmm. And that's basically what's happening. Absolutely. Are they even manned? Uh, maybe? That's my only question, is, is there even a pilot for Most every ship? Most of everything else is automated, so why not? It is too late to retreat, I Because if you can design unmanned fucking ships, then you're, you're golden. Yeah, unmanned ships that fucking get created from, like... A, a handful sized cube of whatever. Suck it. Was that their ship? Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> That's fucking. Whoops. This is Corbin. Malik is dead. All hail the return of Darth Revan, the true lord of the Sith. Lord That's All what I was Lord looking Revan. for. Oh no, this the looks like the no, this is the Rakatan planet. You have claimed your rightful throne. The beach? The yeah, this is the temple. Is in tatters. It is only a matter of I wouldn't have this here. Too many people are close to the thing. The yeah. of the galaxy. The Way too many people close to the thing. The core worlds are defenseless against us. But then again, you're the strongest fuck around. And people have to man this thing. You're a boss bitch, and no one's gonna come at it without getting through you. That's a big fleet. So it's like, how did they do it? Oh, they cheated. They cheated like crazy. Like hard, big cheat CC cheats. The biggest fucking game genie ever. Hey, look, I made a ship. What's it made out of? Nothing! <laughs> oh! <clears throat> well, technically, star energy. Sure, but that's... Because worse. you can't actually make something from nothing. Sure, but they use the force to fudge it a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they're making ships out of almost nothing. Like, it might as well be a black hole. Yeah. Oh, good job, Marwars! Yeah! Look, yeah. oh, Casey Hudson and True Carpition are yeah. there! I saw them! Yay! So, so... Casey Hudson went on to create and ruin Mass Effect. Oh. Hey, look, there's the Doctors. So... Greg and Ray. Now, from everything people have been, like, basically implying and saying and sending and shooting and so on... That's correct. Darth Revan is canon as fuck? Mm -hmm. That's well, cool. In Tor, uh, it is... It, he turned like Sorry, pre-Disney. Darth Revan was canon as fuck. No, I say that, but uh, the general consensus and Dar uh, and Revan is in Tor, straight up. What I mean is, and that's pre in the expanded universe, there is a character named Darth Revan. Yes, that existed. Oh, you're talking about the beginning. Yes. Oh, absolutely. That's a real ass. Totally. Thing. And and Revan, because it was that wasn't video game when, lore. Well, no, when this was invent, when this was happening, anything that happens in Star Wars gets added to Star Wars. Yes, it, yes. it was a blanket rule. Okay. Uh, and the canon uh, ending to this is the light side because the dark side ending doesn't make any sense. 
for the continued Star for Wars the, for, universe. For part two. Well, for anything. Oh, for anything. Really. I mean, Star Forge and the Sith and all that shit. Yeah, you can't. And in the light side, you blow up the Star Wars. Because you're like, this thing's evil, it can't exist. They, they never, never would have stopped it annoying. Yeah, no, it, it would have been game over. All right. Now, here's the other thing. If Jenny isn't with me, how does that, how does that fucking last shot go? I'll fucking know. All right. Some, some generic loser is like, bow down to the Sith Master. I don't know. And if we play it, maybe, maybe yeah, I don't know, do you like save Malak again and then be like, serve me again? Fuck that. Yeah, no yeah, right. way. Yeah. Okay. And then, if you do it like the boring Yon McSnores, yeah. how, how does that ending go? Oh, you're like, oh, look, it's like, it ends like every Star Wars movie. Uh, yeah, yeah, zipping. Wow, we saved the galaxy big with Star Wars, and, and Karth is here. And then Yoda puts the thing on your head, yeah, and then... Yeah, Karth is so happy. He's alive. Look at him. Star and then fucking wipe to credits. Yeah, oh, look, save the galaxy again. So, uh... Regardless of ending, however, good asking. Um, good in, asking. In the sequel, Revan immediately leaves. Like Revan doesn't stay to oversee anything, uh, good or evil. Revan goes, "Oh, I feel something fucking bad coming from out there. I'm gonna get out there," and goes mm. out past the outer rim, mm. like into the void. In in two or tour in two. Okay, and then they come back in Tor. Because mm. the stuff that they go out to check out happens in, in Tor. Mm. It's some alien race beyond the edge of the, uh... Beyond the edge of the void. An idea they later used again for Mass Effect. So why is Tor called Tor? The Old Republic. No, I know, but why is it called... Knight, not Knights of the Old Republic? Oh, uh, because it's a shorter name and it's an MMO and you're not knights. So it's Necessarily, just, it's, it's you could be a bounty yeah. hunter. You yeah. could be a... Whatever. And they kept saying like it's it's ba it's basically Kotor Darth Blah. It's basically Kotor three, and everyone was like, "No, it's not. Shut up." And then, well, apparently, the many of the stories, the Sith infiltrator. There's references. Oh no, it's it's a direct sequel. Okay. Like it is directly after, but like some of all the character stories were written by different teams. Okay. So they vary wildly. So everything that didn't come back in Kotor two, I assume, then gets eventually shows up in Tor. In some. Form, yeah, okay. Somehow. Okay. Like, HK is a raid boss. Right. In Tor. No, because, like, the, the, well, the basis of that MMO is this, right? Yeah. Like they It's did. like the fallout from the two big events. Yeah. Uh, the events that happen on Terrace and Star Forge, and the events that occur at Malachor 5, which is the stuff that happens. Raphael Smarge. Christoph Christopher Tabori is HK-47. Huh. Master uh -huh. Brook was in fact Ed Asner. Yeah. I'm I am I'm I'm definitely curious about uh the, the ending variant, so I'll go check that out right after. But um Honestly you see all the wild ones in uh again in, in the dark side. So okay. again, massive appreciation for me not getting spoiled on this game at any point. Uh I really do Find that's a rarity that like I we barely get anymore, so that's awesome. And having with and having said that, my guesses, while correct, were not so on that I was not still shocked yeah. by the event. Uh, uh, HK's voice actor is pretty much he's done a lot of film and a lot of TV. Cool. This is pretty much the only games he's done. Okay. Which is why we're totally unfamiliar with his voice. Okay. I've never heard a voice like that. Like HK is very distinctive. Hmm. Um, there's also, a uh, uh, fuck, someone pointed out that one of those, um, one of those NPC voices that we keep hearing, the deep-voiced guy, yeah. is someone that we know from another game, and I forget Oh, I'm who. sure. But anyway. Hukushaka Paka. Uh, yeah, 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 no, the, the twists worked out in their details. Special thanks to all these people. They helped out, I guess. Don't know how. Hey, that's weird. They're being alphabetized by their first names. Oh, that's it. That's it. Um, the, the, there's a generic guy we run into all the time, and uh, he's the voice of Skullface. Oh, yeah. So think of Skullface's voice. Yeah. And then think of that guy. He's the same voice as the... Remember the remember when we ran into the, the shopkeeper that was, like, indebted to the, the British fuck yeah. on K? Okay, I can kind of That guy it. voice. My memory on that is not so that's good with Skullface, yeah. honestly. Yeah. 
That's it. That's totally him. Uh, it just dumps you back to the tile screen. Hey, look at this jawless fuck. Hey, look at him. We beat his ass. You're not even that cool anymore. You're a loser. You know what's cool? What's that? Money. Yeah. You know what's cool about money? Where's it go? In these pockets! Yo, good game. Good game. Good game.